Um, yo, staying on legendary women, Beyonce. I love your segues, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, nobody does it better. <laughs> close and close. All right, to the Nate talk, man. Nah, we got we got to talk about your girl Beyonce. Yo, Beyonce number one. I mean, rank. I know you don't like the ranking, but 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 I, I mean, listen. You know, I mean, Beyonce at this point is the is the is is the how can I say it, man? She's just she's just eclipsed so much as far as the industry goes, and her fan base loves her to death. So. I don't got nothing bad, or I I don't have anything bad to say about Beyonce. No, I mean, what? yo, she got you know. something like 32, 33 Grammys, most in Grammy history. I don't think nobody works harder. I don't think nobody no, practices no. and works harder and focuses more on a craft than Beyonce. So. Yo, okay, so I gotta ask you this. You you, you was just talking about Jennifer Lopez. You, you, you think Beyonce is a pain in the neck at home? I don't, you know, that's a, that, that's a good question. I, it, it doesn't seem like it because she stays away from the, from the press and everything, whereas Jennifer doesn't. You know, Beyonce's more, I'm gonna give you what I wanna give you, you know? She's not doing interviews, she's not out there. It's like she knows she's the shit so she don't have to just throw herself out there. And I think she's so comfortable within herself being a shit that it just doesn't bother her in a way. I mean, it just doesn't consume her in a way that these other female stars are consumed by. I think she knows that her work and her body of work speaks for itself. Where these other ones, they just, they have to use other means and methods to stay relevant and stay out there. Well, I'm not even that, talking that, about that staying me, out there. That it's the, it's, the, it's the whole consume of this, I, I have to be this all day, every day that a guy's gonna get tired of. Oh. Beyonce, Beyonce already knows that. So, you know, she's not gonna be all out there. I don't, she ain't gonna be dealing with TMZ and extra and all that shit. She, you know what I'm saying? She doesn't, you know what I'm saying? She's, she knows she's the shit. But you wanna know what's crazy? Cause, cause I, I agree with you wholeheartedly, like real talk. She know exactly who she is. She on a yeah. different stratosphere from everybody. But I don't know if you ever peeped this, but when it come to her man, I've never, ever, ever seen a clip where Beyonce is walking in front of Jay-Z. She always let that dude lead. She's always a step behind him. She making songs cater to you. She, like, Beyonce seemed like as big as I am, in the public eye, at home, I let my man be a man. And, and, and it's like, I don't know what going on behind, the, you know, they fought, they, they, they um, right. Work. But the optics is what you're saying, exactly. Correct. Yes, 100%. And that's, that's what I'm saying. Like, Jennifer's not gonna put Ben in front of her. It'll either be side by side or he'll be in the back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.